1-800-DUIOA, now offering free remote consultations by phone or video conference for any criminal offense. Trust Brooke, Jeffrey, and Jose's friends with a free remote consultation. From Bradley Johnson Lawyers, visit 1-800-DUIOA.com or call 1-800-DUIOA. I think I speak for everybody in this room. Mm. Whenever Brooke tries to act a certain way in front of other people, (laughs) it ends up backfiring on her big time. <laughs> I'm, just, anyway. I'm just telling you, like behind the scenes stuff here. Sometimes Brooke tries to act too cool about stuff. Yeah. And then she gets loud and her eyes get really wide. <laughs> and she's like, What? What? I'm just telling you, shoulder pads are back in style. Yeah, <laughs> You're the uncool ones now. I'm not on TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. And you know, I've not heard the phone tap yet, but okay. I did hear that Brooke tries to act. Young and sexy. Oh, oh no. no! Which aren't really her I thing am sorry. so much. I do not have to try. That has come okay. naturally oh. to me my entire life. Oh yeah! yeah. Give us your best sexy yes. talk right now. Go ahead. Hello, boys. Oh god, oh, the boys are tuning out. <laughs> Hello, girls. Yeah. Like I said, not really her thing. <laughs> But sometimes that's why these are so funny, because we play people that aren't our true selves. So we're going to hear how Brooke does with it (laughs) in your brand new phone tap right now. It's another phone tap. Weekday mornings on the 20s. Hello? Hi, is this Piper that lives in Unit 602? Yes. Who is this? Oh, we haven't spoken before, but my name is Lucy, and I work in the leasing office of the complex. Okay. I was just calling because there have been a couple of complaints when you're walking your dog. Uh, about me? Yes. I, I don't understand. I, I always pick up his poop. Oh. I never just leave it there. No, 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 no. It's not so much about your dog. The complaints have to do with you while you're walking your dog. I, I don't understand. I can't get too specific, unfortunately, but let's just say this, okay? Some of the men around the complex have been saying that you look at them in a certain way. What? And it makes them uncomfortable. I am so confused. I don't know what you're talking about. What are you talking about? You know the gym on the first floor that you walk by when you take your dog out? Yeah, but I don't even pay attention to it. Look... I get it, okay? A couple of attractive single ladies like ourselves, surrounded by shirtless hunks pumping iron. I mean, (laughs) it's hard not to, you know, window shop. Excuse me, I am not window shopping. (laughs) And who's complaining about me? Well, I can't tell you specific names, but do you know Michael? No, who's Michael? I don't know a Michael. Ooh, you should. He's the buffed Latino hottie over on the sixth floor. I, I do not know who that is, okay? I don't know any Michael. Of course you don't know. Okay, yes, because you've never looked at his face. What? <laughs> You're probably staring at those gorgeous pecs of his. Oh, my God. So this is unbelievable. Oh, I agree. <laughs> his rippling biceps are un. Believable. Okay, look. You are speaking my language, girlfriend. I don't know what you're saying, but it sounds really inappropriate. And you're trying to say that you and I are like looking at these guys. I, I don't even know who you are, and I'm not looking at anyone. And you're saying that someone's complaining about me now, oh, and that they're making, oh, girl, I'm making them feel uncomfortable. Listen, Piper. I mean, can I call you Pipes? I'll just say this. No. Even though you and I are dime pieces. Dime pieces. I you, just. I, you did not just say that. Oh, I did. Yeah. And us dimes, we have to be respectable women and keep our eyes to ourselves. I'm just walking my dog. That's it. Mm -hmm. I'm not staring at anyone at the gym. I don't know any Michael. Pipes, that's not what Sean says. (laughs) Who is Sean? Oh, you know Sean if you saw him. Oh. On Tuesdays, I sneak down to hide in my Hyundai and watch him on the bench press. Oh, my God. (laughs) Mama-like. You are the one with the problem. You're the one who's staring at them and making them uncomfortable. I'm just walking my dog. I mean, it takes everything in me not to go up and just say, I wish I was that bench. Okay, you are the weird one. You're the one who's probably making all these guys uncomfortable, and you are making me uncomfortable right now. Do you know what it's taken? It's taking everything in me not to whisper in your ear that you just got set up for a prank phone call. What? This is actually Brooke from the radio show, Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning. We're doing a phone tap on you. Oh, my God.
god! Oh my god! Are you kidding me? <laughs> your roommate Eva told us that you were talking about all the hot guys around your complex, and she said that sometimes you sneak a peek when passing by the gym. I do, but she wasn't supposed to tell anyone. Oh, my god. <laughs> oh, don't worry. Your secret's safe with me. I mean, us dimes have to stick together. Am I right? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Us dimes have to stick together. One hundred percent. Wake up every morning with phone taps. Weekday mornings on the twenties.